Hello, welcome to Artie Makes. I've got a lovely piece of red A4 paper in front of me and I've also got a pen. And I'm going to show you how we can make a heart. Perfect for Valentine's Day. But I've got a uh, slight twist on this heart, so uh, bear with me and I'll tell you what it is. So you need to start by folding your piece of paper in half. Okay, you make a nice clean line down the middle and then you're going to flip it over and you're going to fold it in half the other way matching up those creases down that center point and then if you run your finger down the middle like that and then out to the side you get a really nice crisp fold the next bit is slightly trickier what you're going to do is you're going to use those guidelines and you're going to put the guidelines together so you're going to put the shorter line on that longer line like that so they match up okay so you can get that line that continues to make sure that your heart's um, nice and symmetrical, you also need to make sure that the other line, the other crease line matches up too. So you might need to flip it over and just check that. Once you're happy with it, make a nice crisp fold like that. At this stage, I think it looks a bit like a pair of lips, doesn't it? But anyway, we've got to make it look like a heart. So you're going to fold in one side into the middle like that. And then the other side, you're going to do another fold, but you're going to fold following that crease you're going to fold that one under so you folded one over and one under looking a bit more like a heart or some very very big lips I suppose okay let's make it even more like a heart so we're going to fold in a triangle at the side like that and then you fold it back on itself so this is just sort of making a crease and then you're going to pop your fingers inside the sort of the pocket there and you're going to push that triangle you've made inside and that should just pop inside like that then you need to do the same on the other side so you're folding in a triangle like that making a nice strong fold folding it back on itself and then opening it up and pushing it through and if you've got if you've made the creases nice and sharp then that should work now it's looking like a heart but it's looking a bit bit pointy isn't it and it's also a bit floppy so if we fold the points at the top down just a little bit just making a little um, triangle like that with the fold then that will secure it a little bit more but we want to make sure that it looks neat on both sides so what you need to do is just opening up again like that and you push the triangle that you folded back on the back part in and then that top triangle, put it over the top and it will just kind of like hold it. Now you can put that inside as well, but I think doing this way, doing it this way, does mean that it will hold it closed. So you can do the same on the other side. So making a little triangle, trying to keep it the same as you did um, on the other side of the heart. So it is quite symmetrical. So you fold the back one in and then the top one over the top or inside, it depends on how, uh, how well you folded your paper, I guess. Okay, now we're ready for the secret. So you could actually make a little message here, make it into a card. So I think it's appropriate to put a message something like this. And I'm using um, a Posca pen, but a normal pen would work uh, because I'm just going darker on a dark piece of paper. Okay, so you hold my heart. Oh, what a sweet message. It's up to you what you write inside. And I've even put an exclamation mark at the end there with a heart instead of a dot. So now I need to make sure that that's dry before I close it. So I'm gonna close it carefully, making sure my folds are all in place. And I have a secret message inside a heart. And I've made that. So it becomes even more special if I was to give that to somebody. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. Maybe you could make a heart too. Maybe you could make several hearts, make different sizes. If you do, let me know how you get on in the comments. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel and come back for some more Artie Makes really soon. Take care. Bye bye.